Good day, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the second episode of Legends of Amberland. I'm your host, Huey Plays, and welcome back. So, in the last video, we did a party creation uh, video. So, if we load up the game here, I'll save that as Huey1. Uh, load. Oh, here we go. Um, yeah, we got our party of seven, so we got. I'm gonna need to learn the names. Uh, so we've got Henry the Knight, who is a dwarf. We got Jacqueline the Champion. We got Solomon the Warrior. We got Connac the Ranger. Susanna the Bard. Lena the Wizard. And Erelith the Healer. So I just want to check out the UI here. Um, you know how to. Essentially, how to play because this is my first time. Uh, so, so just one click, we go onto here. So, we only need 84 experience, which is good. Um, 63 hit points. I'm guessing that's pretty good. Um, I'm used to minor magic, where like about 30 is really good uh, to start off with. Um, Alright, so attributes. Alright, stats is what we want. So, 12 to 23 damage. That is what I love to see. Uh, so, is that like 28% chance to hit? Or... I don't know, I'm assuming. Uh, at level 1, this means receive physical damage reduction is between negative 6 and negative 13. That's very good. Uh, so for Jacqueline the champion, she does 10 to 20, 30% chance to hit, I'm assuming. Uh, let me know down below if I'm wrong. Again, yeah, let me know any tips, uh, how you play, or any strategies, I'm all ears. So any tips would be greatly appreciated. Uh, so, so yeah, Jacqueline does 10 to 20, which is, I'm guessing it's decent. What's the talents here? Knowledge affects critical hit chance. Okay. Then we obviously got our resistances, pretty, pretty self-explanatory, and then immunities. Okay. So that's where, in the party creation, uh, last episode, um, we had the chance to. I think it was with the sub races of high elves, maybe or something, or just regular elves, I think. Um, two of the options were Immunities to Confusion and Mesmerize, I believe. Uh, but we didn't go for that. Um, I'm sure we'll get a chance to do it throughout the game at some point. Uh, we've got Solomon the Warrior. Oh, 13 to 26. Does more than uh, good old Henry here. And more HP as well, so... That's what we like to see. And then we got Connacht the Ranger. Does 8 to 15, so pretty balanced. And then, as you can see, he's got Arcane here, so... It determines the mastery level of spells. Okay, um... I'm sure we'll find out more about it. And he's got Awareness, so... Knowledge is added to Dexterity for the purpose of Evade Calculations. Oh, yep, so his Evade is a lot higher. Yep. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, we got Susanna the Bard, so 5 to 10 isn't the greatest. Um, oh yeah, his hit points is 51 and magic's 27. So the Bard here is a lot more balanced, so I guess it makes sense. Um, only 2 armor though. Have to give her some armor. And awareness, so same as Konak here. Uh, increases her evade chances. And then we got Lena the Wizard. Lower HP, but she's got a lot of might points. Magic points, I should say. Uh, doesn't have many uh, damage at all, but that's okay, because look, look at her arcane here. Very good. So her talent is arcane mastery, so arcane bonus from knowledge is doubled. Uh... I'm guessing 20 to that. Her damage from fire damage is reduced. 
and she's also got poison and mesmerize immunity so look out Lena is a beast then we've got Aerolith the healer so he's got uh, just one more HP one less than Lena but doesn't have fire resistance or mesmerize immunity but that's okay Right, so I'm assuming this is our inventory. Um, ah, right, okay. So encumbrance here. So, all right. So we've got a helmet already. We already got full planar armor. Look out! All right. So, okay. So I'm guessing anyone can have full plate armor as long as they have more than twenty. I'm assuming. Uh, it's got a large shield, tier 1, common. Ooh. I like it when there's a lot of variability, so like, I'm guessing there could be like a tier 4, super rare, you know, and has all these stats to it, a lot of stuff like that. Um, Dwarven Axe, 105 damage bonus, what you like to see. Um, little Champion's Helmet. Rolls twice for armor during combat. The better roll is used. Okay, so it must be like um, what I'm trying to think of here. Uh, so roll. So it could be like uh, you roll uh, plus one arm or roll plus two. I'm guessing. Um, I'm probably completely wrong. Uh, let me know down below if you know the answer. Um, so Jacqueline wields a sword and a small shield, so not as much armor as Henry, and a bit less encumbrance, but still has full plate armor, so you know, doing well. Then we've got Solomon the Warrior, he's got chainmail, so he's got seven encumbrance to spare, so we can get him a helmet at some point, get him some plate armor too I reckon, um, and he's got accessory slots, so I'm guessing if it's the same as modern magic, it'll be like amulets, uh, rings, belts, cloaks, stuff like that. Um, who's next? We got Konak, so he's got scale mail. I'm guessing it's yeah, a bit less than chain, but that's okay. Wields an axe and doesn't have much else armor. And we've got Susanna, leather, so that's obviously base. I'm guessing, and then a short sword. Uh, then we got Lena. Typical wizards with their magic staffs. Uh, damage bonus of 50 and arcane bonus of 30. You love to see it. Um, oh, so, uh, I was going to say enemies. Um, weapons also have encumbrance too, which I guess makes sense. Um, okay, so the wizard's hat grants immunity to mesmerize. And enchanted rope. Unique starting equipment. Does every wizard get that to start off with, or just we got lucky? Either way, we'll take it. And then we've got an elven brooch. So there's a piece of the finest elven jewelry made of rare green amber, which has been which has the property of subduing any poison. Okay, so that explains her immunity to poison. Very good. And then we got Aerolith, our healer. Ooh, Enchanted Dagger. So, plus one encumbrance. Uh, plus 50 damage and plus 15 arcane. And he's also got an Elven Brooch. So that explains the immunity to poison. So, very good. Okay. Uh, guessing this is quests, maybe? Yes. Uh, completed. So our first quest here is to visit the royal wizard in the royal castle. Makes sense. The royal castle is located south from Timberburg, the starting town. Okay. And then I'm guessing this is no. Oh, titles and awards earned by the heroic party. Okay. So I wonder if like we get promotions like in Modern Magic. That'll be pretty cool. Um, I notice there was a letter here. Um. Can we read it? It's making noises, I'm scared. <laughs> right click, can we move it? 
a yeah, magic bag of carrying. Um, quest item. Okay, I guess we can't read it. Um, okay, so uh, magic is X. This hero has no magic. I'm trying to press, trying to press tab. Um, that doesn't switch. So I'm just gonna have to click. Um, okay, so let's see what Susanna the Bard has. We got Alvin Song. Ah, okay, so that heals all. Okay, and heal, which is two to nine hit points, and then heals more concentrated, but only one party member. I'm guessing. Um, inspire courage removes a frayed status. I'm guessing that's just for one person. And then song is removed from all party okay and then inspiration plus five strength look out um so it's kind of like um heroism in modern magic a bit um okay uh connect the ranger has alvin song as well and power fist one to 45 We've only got 27, so we'll use that for when we're in bit of strife, I reckon. Uh, Lena the Wizards. Ooh. Ooh. We've got a lot of offensive spells here. Alvin Touch is removed the poison status. Um, Magic Arrow 1. Ooh. 10 to 30. Power Fist 3 to 90. Fireball. 30 to 40, and Cold Ball, okay, um, and then we got Aerolith, our healer, Mass Heal, that would be good, ooh, 30 to 62, oh yeah, and Regeneration, regenerates 5% of hit points every hour, party bonuses affect the whole party, and expires at midnight. Very interesting. Um, all right, so that's our magic uh, info. Information on Western territories, civilized area ruled by human kings. The ruler is King Godric, who resides in the royal castle near the city of Thorncrest. Uh, uh, so it's the year three hundred and five. So it's the date since the Pact of the Trees, which marks the beginning of the fifth era. It's giving me Skyrim vibes how they how they have eras and all that. Uh, let's check our map here. Sent on and summon the Griffin. They say the guild master was imprisoned by some bandits. Uh, so that's obviously like a quest. We've got to rescue him, then we can summon the Griffin. Okay. Um. So I'm guessing this is the whole map here, or when we move, like it transitions the map. Either or is interesting. Um. Okay. All right, let's get started. I reckon. Um. So we can either click here to move, or we can do WASD. Q and E to rotate. Also got building over there. What the hell are those things? Um, so that's obviously a dungeon there, I'm guessing. Yeah, question mark, question mark. Uh, I guess we'll go forward here to this house. Ah, this is a timber bag. Okay. Alright, so we've got 300 gold. Uh, how do we find our food? Uh, replenish food rations with free veggies and free meat rations. Okay. So we can come here to heal. Let's check out the town hall here. So we've got Fargold, the mayor of Timberg. Welcome, travelers, to our small town. There's not much going on here. It's much safer here than in the south with all those ogres. So, if you ever get tired of adventures, I recommend you settle in our peaceful town. Okay, very good. Uh, the inn. So we can replenish food. 
Ah, okay, you can store unneeded items here. Um, I wish Modern Magic had that. That'd be cool. Inn will store them in the magic chest, which is accessible from any inn in Amberland. Let's talk to this fellow. Random hero. Visit the Great Library to find a way to enter the Enchanted Forest. At least that's what my grandma kept telling me when I was young. I have no idea why I'd want to go to some Enchanted Forest. Do I look like a lumberjack? Jack? I can never understand my grandma. Okay, random hero. Nice to know. Um, <laughs> impoverished fur trader. <laughs> this is bad. Many master craftsmen who were providing items for shops in the land were kidnapped by monsters or bandits. Yeah, look, that doesn't sound ideal. Now only the basic wares can be bought. Unless someone frees them, the economy will collapse. Unfortunately, we can't count on the royal knights. Not now, when there is a big ogre invasion going on. So obviously that's where we step in with our elite group of party members. Uh, Traveller. I wanted to comfortably continue on my journey via the Griffin Riders transport service, but some ruffians have kidnapped the Griffin Riders guildmaster. Service is not available until they free him. This totally wrecks my travel plans. Yeah, I love it when your Griffin Rider uh, transport service uh, guildmaster gets kidnapped. Not ideal. Um, trainer, so obviously where we go to level up. Um, we got the shop. Alright, so what do we got here? So we've got six different categories, so obviously our armor here. Ooh, Ranger's hat. Use for Konak. Plus one dexterity. Uncommon, but 300 gold. I don't want to spend it right away. We got a Knight's helmet. Um, available crop. Many master craftsmen who were making items for shops in Amberland were kidnapped. Free them to increase the availability of items in shops. Okay. Seems to me like a lot of people have been kidnapped. Um, yeah, it's a bit of a problem. Ooh, Firebird helmet is rare. Ooh. Okay. Uh, oh, so that's a helmet. Okay, this is our... Okay, yeah, it makes sense. Uh, oh, robes underneath leather armor. Okay. Um, not plain armor. Ooh, that'd be nice. What weapons do we got? Also, I love the music as well. Loving the vibe. Uh, got a dagger, longsword, axe, mace, and flail. Uh, shields, only two. Um, cloak of protection rolls twice. Oh, yeah, so same as I forget who had that. Um, necklace of paralysis protection, immunity to paralysis makes sense. Um, girdle of strength, ooh, that's good. Um, and then we got, I'm guessing, just everything in the shop. Uh, shop used items. Oh, so I'm guessing we can sell what we have. Okay. Um, and then the magic shop. Ah, oh, right, okay. So we got like our standard shop with gold and then crystals. Found in caves and magic towers. Towers. Used as currency in magic shops. So obviously a lot better um, armor and items. Ooh, tier 3. Uncommon. Mithril is an ultralight metal. Any item made of it uses only uses up only half the encumbrance you would expect. Very nice. Ooh, Mithril Mail. Uh, weapons. Short Sword of Accuracy. Um, no shields. Ooh, we got 120 crystals. Increases maximum encumbrance by plus 10. I think that'll be handy. Uh, ultimate Cloak of Resistance. Oh, okay. Tier 5 Unique. I'm guessing that's the highest. 
Then we've got Prismatic Ring here. Um, okay, very, very interesting. Uh, I think it was O for Quest I saw on the... Yeah, okay. Um, the Royal Castle is located south from Timberburg. Okay, so here's Timberburg. So I'm guessing we have to go to another area or it's within Isma. Um, let's try and take out these goblin looking things, I'm guessing. Call it. Every RPG has goblins in the starting area. It's not an RPG until you have goblins. It's just, you know, it's just one of those things. Okay, so we got stuff over here. So we got fight, attack, execute the last selected action, attack or cast spell. No, so that's for like automatic. Attack is F. For melee it's R. To skip a turn is H. Detailed info about the monster is T. So goblins, 33 HP, 6 to 12 damage. Okay, shouldn't be too hard. Um, charge, may only be used once, then you can rest to replenish. Uh, oh, targets all enemies at once, okay. And then flee, um, not always possible, okay. Um, all right, so we're on Henry here, so we'll do Attack. Ooh, 15 damage. Oh god, I forget. Jacqueline, yes. Um, it's gonna take me a while for me to remember everyone's names. But that's okay. He's taken 4 damage. Um, has Solomon. Our first victory, let's go! Love to see it. Plus 5 gold and experience, okay. Ooh. I'm guessing that's two on one tile here, or not just one. Uh, we'll attack. That sounded like my shield blocked that. Very good, alright. Um, so we've got 15 experience, so we only need, you know, around 70. Um, alright, well what's here? I'm guessing a dungeon. I feel like I shouldn't go to any dungeons at the moment. Um, okay, we can't go on water. Well, there's a house over there. I'm guessing we have to learn, like, like in Modern Magic, Water Walk. Um, so I can't seem to go across. That's okay. Um, we'll go around here. So we can see some goblins. Oh, he just come out of nowhere. Alright. Um, attack, attack, attack. Beautiful. I'm liking this so far. We might need to heal, maybe. Oh, no, we missed. Um, who... Um, Aerolith, I want you to... Um, Heal all. Look at that, all healed up. That's what you love to see. I'm guessing. Oh, there's an ogre. Alright, yeah. Oh, there's a boat. We can use that. Um. My aim for this episode is to. Try and do this uh, quest here, and maybe level up once. Um, Alright, focus on the tiles here. Okay, so they can move too. Alright, and they seem to spawn in. Oh, that was a good hit. 25 damage by Solomon. What a beast. Oh, so we've got multiple uh, caves here. Um, do I go? Oh, it's dark. Um, all 
Okay, what's this place here? Gordon the Hunter. Beware of the swamps. The snakes there are tougher than they look, not to mention venomous. Also, don't make light of the troll guarding the bridge. You might want to rent a boat from the fishermen instead. That would be the safest route to the royal castle to the south. Thank you, Gordon, for your friendly advice. Oh yeah, with those snakes. Oh, so that's a troll, I'm guessing. Um, I'm guessing that's a fisherman there. Um, I want to save. Save. Uh, do an overwrite? Yes, I do. So I just want to see how tough. I'm guessing this is the troll. Okay, 620. Uh, does 19 to 38. I just want to see how we go here. I'm just pressing F here. I'm just holding F. Yeah, alright. Um, on the flea and load. I think we'll level up a couple times, we'll get better weapons. I was just curious to see how I'd go initially. Um, fisherman. Want to buy my boat. It's literally the deal of a lifetime, because otherwise you'll die by the hands of the troll. I'm trying to cross the bridge. Alright, we'll buy the boat. Have a nice trip. Cheers, mate. Attack this goblin. Ooh, okay, we're on the boat. Um, I want to go to that house, actually. I want to see if I can. Hold on. Okay, seems I can't go that way. Um, we'll go this way. Alright, no, we can't go that way. Okay, we have to go like... Okay, and then we... Okay, yeah, it makes sense. Oh, one hit, one kill. Look out. Okay, so the map moves... ...as we go along. That's very nice. Um, alright, so... ...the Royal Castle was to the south, wasn't it? So, we're heading in the right direction. Uh, we'll attack the goblin. Um, guess there's another boat over there. Uh, oh, that has to be the royal castle, doesn't it? Uh, maybe. There's information or something. Plark. King Godric, the Sovereign of the Western Territories, resides here. We've got some funky music as well. Um, Alright, we'll go to here, I'm guessing the throne room, yes. Welcome to my court, noble travellers. Okay, so you don't got nothing for us. The Queen's Chambers. Um, look, I think we'll hop out here. Um, okay, here's Fawn Crest. Um, okay, seems to have a bit better items here. Do we have. We haven't picked up anything. Uh, what are we in the magic shop here? Um, Okay, so obviously all the items carry through all the, um, what I'm trying to say, all the shops in the land, um, that's interesting, um, ooh, maybe this is, 
So we've got Orphus the Hunter. Going to the Great Library in the Valley. The librarians there are crazy, if you ask me. I've heard they kept a giant lizard in their basement. Some ignorant librarian got a young hatchling and wanted to keep it as a pet, but it grew and went on a rampage. They are now afraid to enter the basement, but they are too proud to ever mention it to anyone. Totally irresponsible. That's what you get. I'm guessing four. Bit of a typo there, that's alright. We're reading too many books in instead of spending time outdoors, I tell ya. I agree, Orphs. Um, right, what do we got here? Oh, the Great Library, okay. Oh, I don't want to go there, I want to go... It says to the south. I want to go to this house, though. Oh, that was Thorncrest. Idiot. Um, surely the Royal Castle is here. Surely. Well, I don't really know what I'm doing. If I'm in the right place at all. Oh, okay, Old Rock Castle. Okay, I need to check the map and it will tell me where I am. Uh, quest says, oh, visit the Royal wi Wizard in the Royal Castle. It's like a south from Timberburg. Hmm. I feel like I should keep going. It's gonna say on the path. Or pardon the Royal Mine Supervisor. Uh, the mines in this valley are providing 85.5% of the iron used by our blacksmiths and armorers. If Old Rock Castle fall, falls protect. Protecting this valley, we will be out. I'm guessing fails. Fails protecting this valley, we will be out of the iron needed to replace broken gear. Okay. Um, hmm. One hit, one kill. Well, we got an ogre. All right. Be a bit of a challenge. I believe in you guys. I want to heal. Um, spell book. Um, a select member. There we go. We got rid of the ogre. Definitely need to heal. Um, Need to heal Solomon here. Um, Alright. Take out this goblin. There we go. Well, can we level up? Yes, we can. Look out. Oh, yeah. That'll be good. Um, I just want to find this royal castle. Um, oh, is that it? Ah, uh, yep. Yeah. Goblin. Oh, this ogre's gonna get in the way. Well, two ogres. Oh no. Uh. Map. Ogre fort. Well, no, we don't want the ogre fort. Um. Gonna have to find the ogre though. F, F. I want to heal. Uh, we need the bard. Uh, heal. Uh, heal all. We'll do that. Very good. Um, what's in this tent? Sir Garvin, the Royal Knight. 
We are trying to hold the line against the ogres here, but we are short on manpower. Many enemies are getting through. You know, I can see that. Um, hmm. Have I missed? Oh my god, the royal castle is there. That's where I need to check the map. <laughs> oh god. If you're watching this and have played this before, you're probably thinking, what an idiot. Uh, so we'll ju I'll just want to heal up here. Well, I don't rest. Uh, back out. Uh, heal. I want to save. Uh,. So Huey won, there we go. Alright, let's go into the Royal Castle, shall we? Um uh, you are summoned to the Royal Castle. Sorry, I just had to let my dog out of my room. <laughs> um alright, so we're definitely in the Royal Castle, aren't we? Yes. Um, so we just got to look around for the right... Ah, uh, is this... Floor 1. Um, I have been here... You would assume that when you are summoned to a royal castle that you would be seeing the king. Um, but it just says, welcome to my court, noble travellers, and that's it. The throne room. Uh, I guess I'll try and find this wizard, I guess. Um, princess's chambers. Viscaria. Uh, do, 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 do. Yeah, I guess we just gotta find the uh, wizards. Go to the queen. My husband is very busy with the Oregon invasion. Maybe you could help him. Help him. He is too proud to ask himself, but he really needs help. Okay, Queen Theodora. Um. So yellow goes to the next floor. That's a window. Lever, okay. Um, servants. Um, we need to find the wizards. Surely he's around here somewhere. Um, so I've just done a circle here. The ch Chancellor. Floor minus one. Prison. Um, look, I'm probably making a mockery of myself right now. Um, like you would assume, you are summoned to the Royal Castle He's seeing the king. But if he's very busy, don't need to find the wizard. Oh. Visit royal wizard in... Collect three exotic delicacies for the cook from the royal castle. Okay. Um, didn't realize we got a quest. Okay. The Royal Wizard, here we go. Gore Fondor, the Royal Wizard, member of the Wizards Council. Thank you for coming, my friends. I have sent for you because I found a very disturbing thing while paging through the Royal Annals. There is a mention of an old crown that belonged to the Royal Family for generations. Yet strangely enough, no one has ever heard about it. No one. There is no written record of it, save for a single mention in the Royal Annals. That's plainly impossible. 
Upon further study, I discovered something even more disturbing. A powerful spell of forgetfulness of unknown origin has been cast. It caused everyone in the whole land to forget that the crown ever existed. Why would anyone go to such trouble to conceal the existence of some old crown? I need to investigate further. Go to Master Falon in the Great Library. He will give you a book for me. Couldn't go yourself. Um, Alright, so if we go to Quest here. Uh, we... Okay, so we got... Find the Forgotten Crown with this grand quest. Um, go to Master Flon in the Great Library and bring the book to the Royal Wizard. Alright, at least we found the Royal Wizard after all this time. Um, the Great Library was there, yep. Okay. I think I'll finish off this episode here. I think it's a good time to end it. So pretty much this episode was getting myself familiar with the UI, um, with the interface, how to you know, navigate my way, uh, finally finding the Royal Castle, which I already went in, but I thought I didn't. <laughs> um, so that was a great start, wasn't it? But no, it's, uh, it's been really fun so far, actually. I'm quite enjoying it so far. Um, Oh, so moving one tile goes 10 minutes, okay. See, so yeah, I think uh, since we can level up, I think next episode we shall do so. Um, we might go to Fawn Crest, which is just there actually, and level up. So we shall do that next episode, and we shall go to the, the library, see Master Fawn, get the book, go back to the Royal Wizard, which we now know where they are. And yeah, I think we shall continue from there. But thank you so much for joining me on this journey. I really do appreciate you. It has been Huey Plays. I hope you've had a fantastic day. Cheers.